This is Suzanne in France, property reference number SIF 001652. It's an attractive detached house with a tiled roof, straight into the kitchen dining room. She's got a pallet burner. Kitchen to the rear with a breakfast bar, as you can see. Fitted wall and base units, fitted hob and oven. Through then to a corridor at the back, used for storage, and then into the downstairs cloakroom. This is a shower as well. An extractor. Utility area and storage area. Plumbing there for the washing machine and a sink. And then from there you go through to a storage cupboard and then a workshop at the back. This is where you find the boiler and the oil fired the oil uh, storage tank. So workshop space, wood store. And the boiler was through the door that you just saw. Back through into the kitchen. And into the lounge. And tiled floor, nice big window to the front. A fireplace with an inset wood burner. Bit of a murky day when we were taking the film and photos of the property. Then you've got a snug or study area. Second sitting room or playroom. Through then into a study. This could of course be used for a downstairs bedroom. This is the boiler room. A hot water cylinder as well. It's a wood. It's a combination boiler, so I believe that you can use either wood or the oil. Back through the house. Back into the lounge. From the lounge you have this lobby area with stairs up to the first floor. It's so up on the first floor landing now. First of the bedrooms. Built in wardrobes to either side of the bed. Most of the windows in the house are single glazed but have shutters. Actually it's a loft space. Back out onto the landing and a storage cupboard there. Be ideal to make that into an ensuite with access from the bedroom next door. Back out onto the landing. A second bedroom. Again, with built in wardrobes on the side of the bed. A 
and then into the third bedroom. A smaller one this time, the sloping ceiling. An undersized for bedroom, so in France they're supposed to be nine meters squared. This one is under, but obviously, as you can see, it's used as a bedroom. Bathroom with vanity basin and heated towel rail. There's a shower over the bath. Built-in storage. And then separate toilet. Outside now, so there's a car parked there, a side gate and also vehicular access to the side of the property. It's a little overgrown, the house and the gardens could do with some TLC. It will most probably need a new septic tank and the windows at the moment are predominantly single glazed. Nice garden, three quarters of an acre. There are some cracking views over the side of that hedge. And it's been nicely planted as well. So quite a few different species of trees and shrubs. A very attractive house for the region. This is coming through the other access gate. There is a shed and there's also this detached double garage workshop with a mezzanine storage area above. And block construction, solid and a decent size as well. Potential there for conversion into a jeet if you so wish. If you'd like any more details about the property, please head across the website suzanneinfrance.com. Thank you.